Hey, Tipbirds, how y'all doing? It's me, Super Paul Games. I'm getting comfortable. Are, are you comfortable? Get comfortable. Let's all be comfortable. Welcome back to L.A. Noir. Um, the Gas Man. It means he's got to fart a lot. <laughs> oh, my butt. I've got so much butt gas. <laughs> it's the heat. We've seen that before. Let me turn off the light. Mood lighting. Hey, you want to get moody with me? Oh, I'm angry now. I'm happy. All right, you put that insta heat in there. You do that, MacGyver. Bring me back to the '80s with MacGyver references. Sorry, sorry, you're raping you. Phelps is sad because he ruined his career. Okay, everyone, keep it down. No. Cole Phelps joins the arson squad today. That's me. <laughs> How'd you like pork in that German whore, Phelps? <laughs> With sour Phelps crops. is up before a review board in December. Until then, he works the arson desk. End of story. Phelps. Yes, sir. I don't care what you did or didn't do, Phelps. I hear you're a good case man. But if you fuck up on my detail, <laughs> I'll have you out of here before your feet touch the ground. Do we have an understanding? Yes, sir. Cap, we don't want a fucking rat like Phelps. Can it, Tilden? Phelps, I'm partnering you with Herschel Biggs. I don't do partners. You know that, Cap. You do now, Biggs. Social basket cases like you two should get along just fine. I like this. Biggs will show you the ropes, Phelps. This is arson. There are no ropes. It shouldn't take long, then. Start right. with these two. House fires. 326 South Kenmore Avenue. Stefan's family was out of town when it happened. Then go to 4414 Rosewood, family by the name of Sawyer. Fire Brigade will be on location. Are they suspicious, Captain? Fire Brigade you can That's trust. That's for you to find out, Detective. <laughs> get out of here. I like to see him, Captain. Both. He's angry get and out. yells a lot and it's awkward. It reminds me of growing up. I like this guy. Can I call you Daddy? Daddy, I love you. Notice approximately four to five hundred dollars stone overnight in four five nine at first and cash found on persons large donations to be reported immediately. Where'd our friend go? Hi lady. Where'd you go, partner? He didn't even wait for me. Well, this guy's you like look at this clown. Not a clown. Everybody, welcome to my pants circus. Who wants to ride the elephant? I want the green car. Yeah. This is how we do it. Tell me a story. Let's go to the house fire of the Stephones. Look out, fuckwads! You kids don't know how to drive. We gonna do the small talk thing now? Talk baseball, exchange addresses? I don't think so. Feeling down, hotshot? Need a buddy? <laughs> look somewhere else. I like this guy. So this is how it's going to be, partner? I already told you, I don't do partners. I seen you on your first day, hero. Walking into the station with your chest puffed out like a little kid at his confirmation. You wouldn't have given me the time of day. And now you need somebody, and that somebody's supposed to be me. Well, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> That's quite a speech. <laughs> I heard you were the strong, silent type. You cracking wise, Phelps? <laughs> no, Biggs. I'm breaking the ice. Just drive, hot shot. I like our partner. It's like the first day you were too big and strong to love me. I don't even know you. I will never let you hurt me again. I don't know you. Seven's house fire, 9, 10 in the AM. Fire engine. Somebody stole your house with fire. You got some dirt on your big butt. There isn't much left. There never is if the job's done properly. Man. You think it was deliberate? Nah, that's real pain in your face. They would have moved out the things they care about if this was insurance. There's no mileage in this. I like Hello, this Mike. dude. Hey, Hirsch. Cap this one. Yeah. Mike Brannigan, Cole Phelps. 
It's okay, Brannigan. His name may be dog shit, but there's none in his hand. No offense, Phelps. None taken. Do you have anything? The fire started late last night. Stepan's family at Catalina Island. Won some kind of competition. Looks like the only thing they ever won in their lives. Let me come home with this. I'd say they were pretty lucky, really. They don't have any insurance. Everything they own, including the house, is not a pile of rubble. Where are they sleeping? In the car. It's lucky the whole block didn't burn down. Where it is, they're bulldozing this whole neighborhood to build new homes for GIs. Hmm. That's the man in the house. In the ruins. Terry Lady is his wife. We'll take a look around. Come on, Phelps. I like your new partner. He's the dirty cop from the newspaper. How do I like, climb up here? Isn't that the cop who probably died that was pretending to be dead? Can I just step up? I'm trying to investigate my gate. Oh, okay, stairs. Mm. The problem with your house is it. Whoa, it burned down. Oh, they, they're pot. I want to wear this hat. <laughs> Let me put it on my head. It looks kind of like a graduation uh, hat. I've been like, oh, graduated from your house fire. <laughs> I've been like, that's so insensitive, you ass. <laughs> junk. But books aren't junk. Read, kids. They'll make you smarter. The more you know. <laughs> That's my uh, public service announcement. Uh, shitty candelabra. Better man than me to connect that. It was the candelabra salesman. They're always burning houses down. Remember Where is it? This is nothing. It's a shoe. I don't think so. The people here wore shoes. It wasn't a monkey house like at the zoo. So much for my monkey house theory. You damn dirty apes burning down the house. Burning down the house. Excuse me, partner. Why were you? What are you looking at? You're just sitting here popping the squat. It's like I got some gas to release. Oh, I'm the gas man. I see how it is. Hmm. There's got to be some fucking clues. Mr. Stevens, Cole Phelps, and Herschel Biggs, LAPD. I know it's a difficult time, but could we have a word? Don Stevens. You were out of town. We won a prize. We had a wonderful time. Came home to this. Do you still have the tickets? Sure. Clue! It's a formality, but we'll need to speak to the issuing agent. Gulliver's Travel Agency. <laughs> That's a pretty funny name. Can you tell me any more about the prize that you won, Mr. Stephens? A weekend at Catalina Island. My uh, wife got this flyer in the mail from the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. I believe you. Why would you lie about that? Did you enter any kind of competition? My wife filled in a flyer. This lady just rung up and told us we won. It's the first time I ever won anything. Yeah, did they try and buy your house and you wouldn't sell? The redevelopment fund. Did they offer to buy you out? They're building new houses. They showed their money and most of the neighborhood just packed up and walked away. But I never bargained with them. I'm gonna believe you. Maybe I shouldn't, but... GI houses? Yeah, something like that. That's uh -oh. all we need for the moment, Mr. Stephens. Alright. I felt bad for him. My damn sympathy. Alright, let's call him the travel agency. Looking good! That made him feel better. Sometimes you have to use positive reinforcement. You stand there and stop the crowd, guy. <laughs> Hopscotch! I'm doing it backwards. That's the noise you make when you play hopscotch. If you're not doing it, you're not doing it right. Well, 
Building in Better California. That guy's face scares the fuck out of me. Reminds me of the guy from Fringe. See? Paranormal activity. 1247. How can I help, Detective? Give me addresses. I need information on the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Yes, Detective. Just checking. The fund is a semi-government agency established to speed up the building of GI homes. It has private investors as well as a government endowment. Huh. You have an address for them. There is one listed here. Corner of Beverly and Mariposa. Thanks. Thank you. Sexy lady giving me information. Alright, um, wait, we're not done here? Oops. It's stuck. Oh, I'm not on a construction site. I was a bit like, what happened to the house? Herschel, come on. I'm stuck. There we go. Not right now. All right, Herschel, what clue did we miss? Are we leaving Herschel? Is that what you're saying? Let's roll. Okay. Go to the Sawyer's house fire. Have there been any other house fires? This is arson. We get an average of two a night. Does that answer your question? Oh, I almost made it. Tell me a story, partner. Come on. Where'd you learn to ride? Just sit right back in here a tale, a tale of a fateful trip. Look out! It started oh. out one summer's morn aboard anyway, this. Beat the officer. 211 just occurred at 253 Main Street. Unit to handle code 2 identified. Um, let's see if we're close to that. I probably am not going to take it. Wait, is that us? Where is it? Should be a giant yellow. Yeah, we're not gonna take that. That's clear across town. Fuck that shit. Oh, come on! Hell yeah! Oh. I meant to do that. Suck it! For America. I'm doing police business here, thank you. It's all good. Somebody broke my car. What the fuck? Woo! Hey, that house looks cool. Hey, apartment complex. Can I live there? I can't see. How far can I, how far can I drive while looking backwards? I turn driving backwards. I got it. Oh. I got it. <laughs> I drive the rest of the way backwards. We're looking backwards. I got it. We can do it. We can do it still. Yeah, we got it. Hell yeah. No problem. This is the way you should drive. Sudden jerks of the wheel. <laughs> that was cool. Nice hat, dork. <laughs> Hi, Albert. We've got this case. Hey, Biggs. We... You have a pardon? What gives? This is Cole Phelps. You may have read about him. Oh, now I get it. Hello, Phelps. Welcome to the netherworld of ours. Family of four found dead in their beds. Aw. Uh -huh. Heater explosion. Hey, another one. Looks that way. Insta Heat Model 70. Before you get excited, we get a couple of water heaters a month go back. Take a look around the yard and see what you can find. There's obviously something going on. Val. You gonna stick it out, Cole? I'm gonna try, Mal. What have you got? Family by the name of Sawyer. Mother, father, and two kids. All in bed from the looks of it. Oh, I'd say carbon monoxide poisoning. The burns are superficial. Time of death. I'd say about midnight. Anything more exact will take some time to determine. 
Lynch tells me this has something to do with the faulty water heater. Could be. There's been a spate of problems with a particular brand. I've got another angle in mind. You care to elucidate, Detective? This is a murder and not an accident. Sharing information has helped us solve quite a few cases together. I need something concrete, Mal, before the department gets wind of it. I'm in arson for a reason. I feel sorry for your wife and kids, Phelps, not for you. Yeah! But you're a good case, man. One of the best I've ever met. I'll help in any way I can. Thanks, Mal. I'd say that's firm but fair. All right, let's check out Bernie McGee. Aw, poor kids. How about the insurance companies write these incidents up as acts of God? Well, that's morbidly sad. I guess you can't expect it to be a fun fire. So we know when the... This should be a clue? This should tell us when the thing happened. Kind of reminds me of Fallout with all the, uh... Hey, they were reading the same fucking book! This isn't what we're looking for. What are the odds of that? Alright, give me some clues. Clues, I summon thee! Busted ass fan. Oh, stuck. Oh. Hey, look, there's a dog house. Maybe the dog did it. Hello, doggy. They got the world's lowest fence. I want to play with the football. Come on. Football season is coming up soon. It's preseason right now. Excuse me, dish. Dick burger. We even got their car. Come on, there's gotta be some clues around here I'm missing. How can there not be any? Oh, I think I missed a clue at the other place too. There's gotta be something. Hmm. Let me run around for a bit off cam so you don't have to just see that. What was that? Hey, Biggs! Is this significant? Regulator valve. Good find. Detectives, this is the next door neighbor. Detective Phelps, can you help? They were supposed to be going away. They won a trip somewhere. But little Henry got sick, so they had to cancel. What are the chances? Do you know who ran the competition? Gulliver's Travel, up on Santa Monica Boulevard. Suspicious. Uh, you've been a big help. Phelps, the guy across the street. I've seen him before. He likes fire. No, I don't want to chase anybody. Uh oh. Hey, excuse me, friend. Friend, can I not chase you? Heads. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you, you dick. I'm gonna murder you and your whole fucking family. I'm gonna murder everyone you've ever Stop. known. LAPD. I'm gonna murder Santa Claus so you can't get any Don't gifts from him. How do you like that, you fuckhead? Sick of chasing you idiots through all of Los Angeles. Come back here, you fuckles the fuck clown. Oh! You lousy piece of shit. He made a noise like a girl when he got hit. How dare How dare I what? Punch you in the face? Ow! My face! My beautiful face! I've been needing that for face-related activities, you fuckhole! How do you like that? You like all the blood I'm knocking out of your face? Face? Haha! Haha! I like hit him on the side of the head. Ooh! That was a lame finishing move. Finish on fence! 
Lock him up, boys. He's arrested for running What's your away. Name? Herbert Chapman. So you like fires? Some. Watching them were setting them. I don't want any trouble. Turn out your pockets. You're a naughty boy, aren't you, Herbert? I keep myself to myself. So I see that's, uh, you like the cigarette and it comes down and then it hits the matches and it all goes off. Cigarette in a matchbox gives you a five or six minute delay. You want more time, you use a mosquito coil. Don't you, Herbert? You like this fire, Herbert? Hell no. I heard it over the fire radio. Sounded sweet. When you finish following your leads, come and see me at the fire station. I have a theory about this. All Don't right, fireman. Later. Take this guy in. We might want him for questioning later. You got it, detective. Yeah, I do got Why it. That's such a hard on for this case. If it is murder, it's almost impossible to prove. Fire doesn't leave much evidence. There's no percentage in this. I think it's more than one case. They're house fires, Cole. Accidents, heater fires, gas explosions. There's got to be a reason. The reason is you want to be a star again. Forget it. Give it up. You'll feel better. There's something to this. I know it. What are you talking about? Arson is insurance. It's always been insurance. We still investigate the cases, Biggs. The people in this house are dead. Go soak your head, Phelps. This hero business is a full-time obsession with you. I'm going to make this case. I'm going to rub the department's nose in it. Help me or stay out of my way. You got it? All right, so, um... i got to go somewhere next, then. Let's go to... Gulliver's Travel Agency, I guess. Because the other thing's not crossed off, we probably missed something there, but fuck it! I don't get paid to pay attention. I got paid for my awesome driving! Fuck you, wall! Okay. Look out, people! I'm insane! <laughs> they're gonna be grateful that they're alive. They should thank me. After today, they'll have a new respect and joy in life because I didn't run them over. Look out, fuckers! Time for police work. Oh, shit! I think I broke my car. I'm just gonna park here. What's your problem now, partner? I'm gonna get a new ride. This seems kind of spiffy. Excuse me, sir, I want your ride. Be careful with it, copper! Out of the car! I'm Police. the epitome of careful. Haven't you seen me drive? They call me Mr. Careful. I don't know who calls me that. Probably nobody, but whatever. See you. This is my jam, my mellow nighttime jams. I'm just not off at the wheel. Shh. Oh god! Oh, what happened? What happened? I fell asleep at the wheel. <laughs> Oh, look out, everybody! That was an awesome turn. What's that? What do they sell there? Shoes? I need shoes. Gulliver's Travels. I like how they have a plane for their top. That's pretty cool. I want to see the building fly away. People in there look like they're horrified, though. They're like... Do people still use travel agencies? I don't know. Detectives Phelps and Biggs, LAPD. John Cunningham, can I help you, gentlemen? Second you have reason to believe that the Sawyer family of 4414 Rosewood Avenue recently won a competition run by your company. Yes, I remember them. They called up to cancel at the last minute. One of the kids was sick. Very unfortunate. Do you mind if I take a look at that? Um, <clears throat> so what am I looking for? Collected on hold. 
I mean, that's them. The Sawyer family, Rosewood Avenue. And those were the Steffens. That was the other family. Here they are, Steffens. Tell us about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. There's not much to tell. They run a promotion. Our promotions mailing list covers half of LA. He's very like, hmm, serious. Whatever, you're telling the truth. I don't care. So they are not a government agency? <laughs> I don't believe so. Government organizations don't usually get involved in promotions. Tell us about the contest. I'm told the tickets were a prize. Yes, they were. You do a lot of these prizes. Look, there are hundreds of these promotions running at any one time. If you're the lucky guy, you get your name pulled out of a hat. Mm, I don't think you're being 100% straight with me, fuck nut. I don't think I have anything to prove it, so I'm just going to doubt you. While the Sawyer family were supposed to be at Catalina Island, their house burnt down. You consider them lucky. Christ. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me who offered the prize won by the Sawyer family? Sure. Look, there's supposed to be some sort of supervised draw with hundreds of tickets. But the reality is the Suburban Redevelopment Fund calls me every couple of weeks and tells me exactly who has won. Thanks for your help. Uh, no problem. Wish I could do something for that family. You could put round the hat. A few bucks would really help them now. I suppose so. Good. I'll put you down for 50. Oh. I could tell you were Samaritan the minute I walked in the I like our partner. You good man, Cunningham. You're all right. Yeah, I'm great. Poorer, but great. <laughs> Whoever did the acting for that bit, if you're watching right there is the travel agent, I admire the bit you did. It was very good. It was really fun and clever. All right, so where to now? Um, suburban redevelopment, I guess. Do you really want to go there next? Hmm. Give me a moment to con All right, I don't remember what the hell I was doing. I really just used that as a chance to go get a drink. Let me guess. You want to check out the suburban address? Great partners must think alike. I like Kershaw because I crash into things and he just doesn't give a fuck. He's like, I got no fucks to give, my friend. I'm just mellow like that. They call him Mellow Yellow. See, once in a while I can drive good when I want to, but now it's time to get a drink and drive with no hands. Brother! I'm driving with my chin. Oop, I got it, I got it. There we go. I almost got it. Come on, just trying to have a drink at the same time. Ooh, cool car truck. Cut it out! No, oh, come on, I'm just having fun. What happened to my car? I'm just drinking and driving. Don't do that, kids, it's bad. Your truck's a piece of shit. Oh, my car! My car! Who do you think you are selling magazines in my it's town? Edition, hot off the press. Yeah, no! Excuse me a second, everybody. I got a shop. I got a hustle the shop. Keep. Get Keep away. Walking, pal. Fuck the old media. It's time for Get the internet. Get away. No. You're disgusting. No one wants your papers. Ah. Oh, thanks. That honk let me know there's time to get in a car. Please get out of LAPD, my vehicle. LAPD, police emergency. Be careful with it, copper. Fuck off. I'll do what I want to your car. Hey, sec- No, let the redhead stay. Hey, sexy lady. It's not my car there. Somebody else doesn't know how to drive. <laughs> oh. Come on, let's go to Tit Town. Population me. Excuse me. At <laughs> least we'll know where we've been if we try to retrace our steps. That's a good call, dude. I'm like fucking Hansel and you're Gretel. My partner's like a little German girl. Oops, I forgot Please. this is a cop car. I tried to turn on the siren and it was just like beep. Oh, fuck. Why did you stop into the intersection, dummy? That's a bad idea. 
Oh, this car didn't come with a hood, apparently. <laughs> that seems like a bad design. Hmm. Oh, that guy tried to sideswipe us. What you Thanks Not for your good. Woo! <laughs> I got scared shitless. See him running. All right, we're good. Here we are. Look at our car smoking. <laughs> the Elysian Fields. We go here to die. Don't run. Don't this want to is chase. This supposed to be the registered offices of the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. This is an Elysian housing development, Mac. So Elysian is an investor in the redevelopment fund. Looks that way. Are we done here, Mac? I've got work to do. Sure, buddy. Thanks for your help. Elysian are investors in the suburban redevelopment. So what? If you think I'm putting my pension on the line and harassing Leland Monroe without evidence, you're out of your mind. Who's Leland Monroe? And where do we go now? Let me get out. Oh, there's a gold doorknob there. So we can go in here. I think we're supposed to have a warrant. <laughs> I just came in and started looking at this shit. So Elysian Fields builds the houses while the Suburban Redevelopment Fund foots the bill. Hmm. We're getting um, nut jobs planned to launder money. Hi, Creepy McGee. How you doing? Do we call on that thing with that clue we just got? Let me look at the clue a second. Is that in there? What? We just, we just saw the thing. Peeps? I don't even know who he is. Okay, Don, his house burned down. The Sawyer family, they're dead. We saw their corpses. Joanna was the witness. We saw Bernie McGee. Chapman's Bernie McGee. And I don't know who this guy is. Oh, he was travel agent, dude, whose acting job I liked. Well, case closed, everybody. Let's go home. <laughs> What the fuck do I do now? Do you guys got any clues for me? Anything. Well, I don't know what to do now. We go back to Stefan's house, I guess. Did I miss something there? I don't think I did, though. See if there's a phone around here. Let me look at that clue one more time. I'll be... Oh, I closed the doors behind us? Cool. Give me that fucking clue. Is that it? This is where the LPs I always... Ooh, ladies. Fappity fab fab. Don't watch me fap! I'm alone! Yeah, fuck off! My wife left me! Because I was boning some kraut, apparently. This is all I got. Let me lick your booty. Uh, it tastes like ass. You need to buy some toilet paper. Alright, let's roll, dude. That's normal. It happens. Get in the vehicle! Boner. Quality is an American trait. And Americans recognize quality whether they're in New York Milwaukee, Chicago, Walrus, and Dallas. The same goes for quality beer. Take Linux beer, for example. Perfect for wedding time. Mm, beer? Why don't I have a drink right now? I have one by me. Trying to drive with one hand, one on the accelerator and on the wheel. Um, why didn't that... Take it easy, Phelps. I'd you take it easy. Point. This is what I do when people tell me to take it easy. I have enough of being told what to do! Alright, you have no idea how much time I looked around. I went back to the first site and I missed this obvious clue right here. 
Insta heat box. Recently serviced. Could be something to go on. Lynch says we should visit him at Fire Station 32. All right. Who exactly is this guy, Lynch? Lynch is a legend. You should feel privileged. He doesn't let many people into the inner sanctum. That means his butthole. And you'll learn something about fires. I'm not putting it in his butthole. He might want that, but I won't do that. All right, we gotta go find uh, Lynch. Oops, what the fuck? I don't need to use intuition. Do they have one intuition point left? Did I use them all? I wasn't paying attention. Do to fire station 32. Be inconspicuous. Hey, what's up? This is mine. I just let me in the fucking. Oh fuck you, game! I just wanted to ride in the fire truck. All right, let's get in the cop car. Just a second, dude. I'm not gonna leave you be, cause you're cool. Come on, Herschel. Herschel. You're falling behind, Herschel. Herschel, don't stand there. Get your shirt on. Here I come. No, you're not. You're not going anywhere, Herschel. Herschel! Herschel? Hers not Herschel. fucking with you like it did the other guys. Oh, well. I'll meet you there, Herschels. Hey, sexy mama! I'm not drunk yet. I've had plenty to drink. I mean, I have not drunk plenty. I like good and plenty. No, I like Mike and Ike's better. I tore off part of a tooth with one once. I was like, crunch, 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 and pulled part of my tooth off. I was like, oh! Sexy noises. Ladies are going to be like, let me play that over again. Oh! Oh, Super Bowl. That was hot. Well, like, not. Whoa! Sorry. Not good. Who said not good? I'm the only one in the fucking car. I like the white walls. Aren't those cool? And I like the rims. That's really boss. Look out, fucker! Careful! You ruined my jump! We're doing this again Grand Theft Auto style. This thing has got hardly... This has got one speed in reverse. <laughs> Alright. Roads where we're going! We don't need roads! Should have pushed that off. Woohoo! If I'd have had more speed, that would have been more awesome. Whatever. I was so lazy to do the Back to the Future game. I don't know what game I'm going to do next. By the time you see this, or very shortly, by the time the month is done, I'm going to be done with most of the LPs I'm currently doing. See, every once in a while I can drive nice like that. Most of the time, it's funner to crash into shit, though. Fireman, I'm here! We came as soon as we could. I don't recognize what him without his doing? hat on. Who are you? Lynch. That's the creep. Biggs? Walked out on his bike. You two investigating the house fire on Kenmore Shut Avenue it. as well? Yeah, what? Yep. Why? I had to look around the place while I was out there. Do you believe the fire? I deal in facts, Phelps. Evidence of an explosion. No obvious sign of accelerants. Wiring looks intact. Come and take a look at this. It's a heating unit. Or stove. Is this the heater from the Sawyer fire out? Yes, it is. Huh. Looks like it was recently serviced. I have a theory, and it's a theory only. I don't have enough evidence to prove... Al, if you say it so, we're listening. Okay, Phelps. You're a bright penny. You have a gas supply. You have a Bunsen burner as a pilot light. You have a regulator valve, and the balloon represents the gas expanding in the room. Now, the gas has to make contact with the mosquito coil to form an explosion. Let's see if you can work out the chain of events. Well, do I really have to? So I can move stuff? What's this? It's a regulator valve. 
And then... I don't think that goes next. No, I wanted the fucking bunts that the balloon thing. The gas bubble needs to be next to the coil if it's gonna ignite. It's next to the coil, fuckhead. Uh, no, I put it down. Uh, no, I didn't. Good, your regulator's in position. I was thinking I got one right. Yeah, I, th I thought the... Oh. You shouldn't be so close to it. Come on, Phelps. You need to get the arrangement right before we can reproduce the results. <laughs> Why do you need me to do this? It's your experiment. So I was right originally about where... I just had the regulator and the tall thing in the wrong place. Put magic balloon over here by the mosquito coil. There you go. Okay. I'll light your pilot. And turn the gas. Burn the things lever, down! Have to turn on the gas. Oops, no, no. Sorry. Whew. So that's how it's being done. Maybe. There could be a fault with these valves. I've adjusted this one for our experiment, but you need to take it to InstaHeat and see what they say. Their headquarters is on North Harvard Boulevard, number 262. Thanks, Albert. You're welcome, Biggs. See you at the next show. The gun show? Because I'm... Oh, I'm gonna... Can we steal Jesus the vehicle? Cole. What's wrong with a good old-fashioned black and white? Come on! We can show them how serious we are about fighting fire. The next fire. We should go to the factory and see how many of these things are going bang in the night. You know this Chapman character? Guy's a freak. He loves fires. He's the kind of guy that would like for a lot of things. We don't really have any credible evidence to pursue him with. Any sentry unit, any sentry unit, 211 in progress, 522 South Hill Street, unit to handle code 3, identify. Yeah, I'm not gonna handle that. Why? We're driving a fucking fire truck. Sorry, Whoa, shop owner. What are you doing? It's alright. I made it easier for people to window shop. Five finger discount. I broke the window. Yeah. Oh, stealing. You shouldn't do it, but sometimes it's fun. <laughs> I'm, not eventually, I'm not exactly the best role model in certain things. Look out! Look out! You're all insane! This is the way you want to go. You're welcome. Safeway? I didn't know they had Safeways back then. Why is that guy driving backwards? He's trying to steal my moves. That's a dick. Yay! Oh! Where's your respect for property, Cole? It's all good. I like the fire truck because we can push everything out of the way. We should have had one of these all this time. Or can we get an Abrams tank? That would be pretty cool and time appropriate. There should be some more surplus tanks. That's how they get rid of them, right? You just sell them to people. Instaheat Factory, 2.50 p.m. Is it like canned heat? Eat. Oh, it says heat. I thought it was just telling me to eat some food. You have vagina. I like LAPD vaginas. Detectives, ma'am. We need to speak to someone in charge. I see. Well, duty manager for today is Mr. Rasick. You should find him in his office. You have a cute voice. Can I fuck your voice? Can you a fuck off, Herschel? Right? Can I put my dick in your voice? It's really kind of cute and sexy. I like it. 
Women love it when you say that to them. I didn't come to or guys, if you're a lady, secretary. tell a guy that you want to fuck his voice. <laughs> hey, sex, sex critteries. This guy must have escaped from the loony bin. Oh, he's not straight. Did I go the wrong way? I don't know. I just started opening fucking doors and shit. Look who's it? Sam's taking me out to Palm Springs for the weekend. Where's the clue? You drove me up to Mulholland? Instant heat! New and improved model. They'll be selling these like hotcakes. Like hotcakes! I mean, unless you work at the International House of Pancakes or Waffle House, where else are you like, they're selling like hotcakes? Fucking A. I'm gonna go Waffle House now. Are you liquored up? Yes! <laughs> you always want to have enthusiasm. Hey, would you like to buy some... Oh, it's just a dude. I was gonna ask them if they wanted to buy my dick in their face. I'm gonna make them take me But, to you know. Hey, Baldy Buggie! Arson. We're investigating a couple of house fires. What can you tell us about this? Pressure regulator from my Model 70. Uh, let me take a look. Do it! Quit fondling it, you fondler. We have a problem. This has been tampered with. What? You see this diaphragm? It forms a seal across the saddle here. Gas flows across from here to here. The diaphragm regulates flow. It's been reversed. It's a subtle change, but it means the gas never closes off properly. I want to hear about your Insta Heat model. So you're telling me that this is not a manufacturing fault or service repair? I don't think there's anything inherently wrong with the design. Yeah, you do. I saw your eyes shifty. Uh, Maybe. You're telling me that you've never had any problems with this heater? Look, we've changed the design since the Model 70. These things are still being installed? It's the demand. None of us could keep up with the amount of housing going up. At the budget end, we're still using some of the old stock. We are installing 100 heaters a week. They're not all faulty. That's They're great. They're not all safe, either. They're not all faulty. You might just die. Can I look up at him? Oh, he's... <laughs> Is he trying to eat something? It looks like in a cartoon they have a bird in their mouth. Like Sylvester does and he's trying to hide it. Don't eat Tweety. Uh, we could do this some other time if you're not... SHUT UP! <laughs> Are these diaphragms prone to failure? They uh, tend to go after a while. The rubber lasts quite a few years and then it perishes. So the guy's names that I've been seeing doing the repairs on the heaters... They're fully licensed and accredited. Sure, of course they are. Um... You're lying. Like, there's no way. I think you're lying, Rasik. I think some of your men aren't fully licensed. You're desperate to cover your sales. And how are you going to prove that, Detective? Name me one of my guys who would have overlooked a fault like this. I only know one of your guys. <laughs> um. Which one? What about Matthew Ryan? Uh, you know about Ryan, huh? All right. He's been in some trouble. I know that. He's done his time. You in the habit of hiring criminals, Rasik? I need guys, Detective. This boom is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I want you to get me a copy of the list of your installers. Okay, I'll get it for you. There, around a dozen of them. Rainbow Housing business is going crazy at the I moment. wanted to be when I grew up. This is a long shot. We are not going to rouse that whole list. Why not? It wouldn't be that hard to contact them. I want to run it by R&I. Cross-reference for arsonists. See if any of these guys have any previous. Sir, I need to use your phone. Go right ahead. I'm going to call long distance now. Let's call New York and get my Broadway play what going. What are you doing? Um, where's the phone? Uh, 
Are you liquor? Thing that's digging. Hear it. Oh, there it is. You start it, I'll finish it. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. Yell it. How can I help, Detective? Uh, you got a problem, pal? I need to know if any of the following names have a previous criminal history. Okay, Detective. Run this is fucking name. better than Google. Acevedo Ernesto, Clemens Walter, Elgram John, Gable Leroy, Kelly Peter, Cutner Robert, Limehouse Albert, Manning Franklin, Neves Raymond, O'Brien Thomas, Ryan Matthew, Spurgeon William, Barley Reginald, Zurich Stephen. Clemens Walter, previous conviction for arson and malicious damage. Burned down a house in Westwood in 1942. Four year jail term. Thanks. Ryan Matthew, charged for contempt of court, attempted murder. He was on our list. They bargained down to assault charge. Anyone else? There is a Reginald Varley wanted for murder by Detroit. Detroit! Detroit! Thanks. You've been a big help, young lady. Go Tigers! This is going to be a little bit before this cunt came out. The is quite the rogues gallery, Mr. Rasick. Desperate times indeed. Lions played their the first uh, oh. preseason game against the Jets last night. They were pretty good. Okay, so we got to... Oh, wait, let me see if I can talk to them anymore. Because my partner's still sitting there. <laughs> I quit walking to the wall. Um, okay. Do you have an address for Clemens? He's uh, working on an apartment building on uh, Catalina and 3rd. What about Ryan? Currently working at a housing development on Normandy and 1st Street. Varley, where is he? Beverly and Mariposa currently working on a new housing development. Hey, Man. Molly's a good guy. You can't harass all my people. These guys have lockers. Yes, they do. But my men have a right to some privacy. Don't you need a warrant or something? Show them and keep quiet. <laughs> no, because if we get the evidence illegally, it can get all thrown out in court. Here. Happy now? You think Stick the fucking lawyer's not going to do that? Clemens is a fellow traveler. Oops, I wasn't done investigating that. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Open this back up. I'm not reading that shit. Wait, then why did I... I don't care about the anarchist. So he's an anarchist. Big fucking deal. Ryan's one of the guys we know. Not everything here is going to be relevant. See that? Hmm. Some light reading on the merciless capitalist machine. Ryan wants the world to be a better place, don't we all? Hey, he's got sexy ladies. Let me just jizz in here for a second while I look at his sexy ladies. Seems okay. He'll think it's his own jizz when he gets back. <laughs> Barley. Hey, he's not an anarchist like the rest. The company went through thousands of these in the war. Still got eaten alive. Barley oh. has a problem with bugs. See, Varley had the mosquito coil. The other guys only had the anarchist cookbooks. Well, not cookbooks. You know that a mosquito coil takes an hour to burn down, Rasik? No, I didn't know that. It's the favorite choice of ignition by arsonists. Gives them time to get away. You're crazy. He probably lives near the canals in Venice. 
Mind if I leave you to it? I yeah, go do whatever you. you want. I'm going to the toilet and poop. Three birds. Clemens, Ryan, Varley. Where to, Phelps? Hmm. Well, I know Ryan had one of the burned houses. Oh, what'd I do? Just walked outside. Triggered a cutscene? Case solved! We're done! <laughs> Yay! Don't burn down that car. I could wreck it for you. A lot faster than you can burn it. Hmm. Turn around so we can see who you are, please. That would help us with our crime solving. Are we back? Why are we back here? Why is he kidding? <laughs> Uh, no, 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 no. You gotta be kidding me. We're driving this? No, we're not. We're still in an insta heat truck. How are we gonna look getting around in this thing, boy? We're gonna look awesome. Hmm, let me think a second. I wanna see Ryan, but usually they have them in order for a reason. I guess we'll go check out Clemens. We'll just go in order. Let's do this shit. Oh man, this thing's got no pickup. I should have realized better. Or known better. Turn up our radio! Can't see! Yeah, this is the only way to drive. Oh, I got it! I got it! Cinematographical! Yeah, this is the way everybody's gonna be driving in the future. We have little cameras mounted there. Oh, please don't do that, dude. I can't see how to take the turn. I got it! Ah, sweet. I'm telling you, when you play Grand Theft or any game, why do they give you this camera option? <laughs> this is the only way to drive. I like when they do that intersection, this is even harder to drive. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Oh, wait, we gotta take a left here. Ooh, got it. This is a racetrack! Fuck you! Oops! I got it! Ha ha! Oh! Beep beep! You're in my way! Sweet! You can see the smoldering ruins over there of one of the houses that burned down. I'll tell you what though, I like this partner way better than that Vice City... Vice City, I'm sorry, Vice Partner. I have Vice City on my mind because sometimes I think about maybe uh, LP in that game. I don't know. Alright, let's go talk to uh, Clemens. Oh, I squished up the car. Sir, maybe we have a word. You. Biggs, LAPD. We want some answers and we want them quick. Okay, okay. What's this all about? Just tell me what you want. Booty? Sexy lady booties? You know Reginald Barley? No? Can't say you, I do. Bullshit. I doubt you. Detroit PD is after Reginald Barley for murder. You want us to run you in for aiding and abetting Clemens? Whoa, 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 whoa. All I know about Barley is he gets kickbacks from some developer. Does their work first. Spreads it around if you can. Just like a slutty lady. Spreading it around. And work for Instaheat? I contract for them. So what? I don't think we have any evidence. Oh, that's too much evidence. Fuck it. I doubt you. Instead hires arsonists, does it? I've worked as a fitter all my life. Put everything I had into that house. And my fucking mud shark of a wife gets awarded it in settlement. She's blowing spicks two at a time while I'm at work. <laughs> and she gets the house. Yeah, I burnt it all right. Set fire to that fucker and watch it burn to the ground. I did my time and I'd do it again. Sorry about the Ralphs, Clemens. You did the right thing. Uh, do you know Ryan? Do you know Matthew Ryan? No. Don't know the name. Then why'd you guys... Didn't they both have... Those pamphlets? Is that the one I use? Yeah, 
They both had these pamphlets. I think he's bullshitting. Why would they both have the exact same thing? You and Ryan are fifth columnists. And how do you figure that, wise guy? What proof do you have? Been following me to meetings? You had... Uh, uh, which one... You had one of these leaflets. We found a pamphlet in your locker, Clemens. We can add your name to the register. Hueck might want to interview you. That shit was from Ryan. He's always pushing that shit on people. Drives me nuts. He's got it in for the company. All right, Clemens. You're off the hook for the moment. Can I get back to work now? Let's get out of here, Phelps. He ain't our guy. Suck a dick. Let's get a better vehicle. Used to heat vehicles are shit. Okay, so our next destination is... I'm gonna guess Varley's... Or Ryan's the criminal since he's last in the list. Um, next we'll go find Varley. Let's go find a sweet ride. Fuck you! Don't be honking at me. Where you get off. Doodle Burger! Let's go! Shake a leg, Herschel. Let's move it, bro. Let's do it. Ready? Let's roll. Barley's on the run. He might be packing heat. He's wanted for murder. We say we take the doubt out of the equation and let him have it. You nervous? It's been a while. You were in combat. In 1917. You know, I never fired my weapon in the line of duty. That's nothing to be ashamed of. I hope your piece is still serviceable, Herschel. My dick pieces. I may be old and out of practice, but I'm still a Marine, Phelps. <laughs> it would be better for our case if we could bring him in, Herschel. Why don't we just murder him? We haven't murdered anybody in a while. Varley's worksite, 719 p.m. LAPD, Varley! Don't run! <laughs> Stop or I'll shoot! Shoot! Just shoot! Just shoot! Oh. So tired of chasing these tards everywhere. Come on, Barley! You can't keep running forever! <laughs> oh, come on! How is that a failure? I say that's a success. Case closed enough. Case closed enough. Oh shit! I figure it good enough, so I killed him. We can just say he committed the arson and move on and get a donut. Let me be a cop the way I want to be. Jimmy Carter! Where's your habitat for humanity? Why don't you stop him? He might be Baby Carter at this time, but whatever. run all the way from Michigan, Reginald? Michigan, yeah! <laughs> That's what you get, Phelps. That's what you get for trash in Michigan, you fucking asshole. Don't ever disrespect the... <laughs> the, um, go blue. Or Spartans, I don't care. Whatever you're into. Go Lions. No. Freeze. I like how Phelps just took a bulldozer and got up and kept running. I like how the bulldozer guy didn't stop. He's like, I'm just going to push you down. Michigan! Why did you run from us, Farley? I'm going to take a wild guess that you're the same Reginald Farley. The Detroit police have an outstanding warrant on. How am I doing so far? I need a lawyer before I talk to any of you. Reginald Farley, you're under arrest for committing a series of arsons. You're also under arrest for murder. Detroit PD will be putting in a request for your extradition. Until then. Your guest is Arson? You, you can't hang that rap on me. Be quiet. Be thankful we don't shoot you. Are all the cops in this town crazy? Take him away, officer. See you, butt bunch. Case closed. The truck's pretty in the background. I'm gonna go sit in it. <laughs> This is my victory. 
a truck full of dirt. I'm guessing we're not done though. Let me see. All right, let's uh, go talk to Ryan. Maybe Ryan did it. I don't know. Maybe they both did it. At least that Varley guy should be going to Detroit and being put down. Oh, it's right around the corner. That's convenient. Somebody's going to be like, you stole my dirt! It hurts, doesn't it, when I steal all your dirt? Creepy face. Are you Matthew Ryan? Who's asking? Don't run. Detective Phelps and Biggs. Arson squad. Arson. You heard the man. Don't run. I'll just put this stuff in the car and I'll no, be right with you. No, stop it. Shoot him. Shoot him. Ryan. Shoot him. I said, son of a bitch. Uh. Those are GI's backyards he's crashing through. The damage is only cosmetic. He's a one-man wrecking ball. Move in. I'll take out the van. Doing what I can. Holy fuck. He's going to kill those men. They'll get out of the way. Only if they hear him coming. Close in, <laughs> Phelps. We need to take Ryan down before he hurts somebody. Yeah, I think I'm more worried about me hurting somebody with my driving. Don't leave me hanging out here, Phelps. Move in. Oh, man, I did fuck him up pretty good right there. Lay into his wheel well. Oh, man, I think he just hit somebody. I was too busy watching him run over people to pay attention to where I was driving. He's got an arson-related assault charge, and he's running. Running don't mean nothing. We gotta get this guy in the room before we can get an angle on him. This man has got to be stopped. We got him. Not now! Don't yell at me. He's on... <laughs> Look how he's pointing. Right there! Yeah, I see him. Put your hands where I can see them. I don't know where my partner went. Why did went. you run, Ryan? I was scared. You got a reason to be scared, Ryan? Matthew Ryan, I'm arresting you on suspicion of committing a series of arsons. Fuckhead. You fuckhead. Nobody likes you, Ryan. Dumb thinking you're better than us than your over coveralls, covering all your fat booties. Get out of here. Snap. That's my ankle. I'd like to impress you by breaking my ankle. Snap. Oh, look how tough I am. We have three suspects. As much as I'd like it to be, Chapman, I think it's one of the other two guys. Yeah. Let's get to the station and close this case. Woohoo! KGPL to any central unit. Meet the officer, a hit run felony at 6th and Alvarado. Any Is that close to us? Let's find out. I'll take it if it's close to us. Um. I'll hear near Hollywood. Nah. That's farther than I want to drive. What are these? Clement's work site? Stephens, are those all the places we went to for clues? To identify. These episodes get so long. I'm sorry how long they are. They're just how long the missions are. I just figure that... Oh, sorry. Oh, for God's sakes. I can't look and talk and drive at the same time. That's a lot of shit. <laughs> I just figured that they're better in big pieces. I don't want to upload like 50 different videos. It takes me forever to upload these though. It's like you gotta watch a movie. I think... I don't know. I wish you could change the radio stations in the cars though. I want some early rock and roll. I don't know, maybe it's too early for Chuck Berry. I forgot what year this was set in. Hey, that's the church. Is that the church that the, uh... Oh, that's a different building. I thought that was the church that that murderer was at. <laughs> Wilshire Police Station, 7.30 p.m. What's up, boys? In the bathtub, and they'd taken one of his fingers. Ew. I have two suspects. Phelps, you got nothing. Biggs, Ryan's waiting for you in interview one. Farley's in two. Hey, Hopkins, you practicing your asshole routine again? <laughs> oh, 
Oh. This guy must have I like our partner. I like the guy at the thing too. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Which one is it? Ryan Varley? Save yourself some time and get this thing off your chest. <laughs> if that's your opening gambit, you better try again. Confess? Confess! No one expects the Spanish Inquisition. So you want to change the world, Ryan? Yes, I do. So does every reasonable person. And you're doing your part? Yes, I am. Does that include sabotaging water heaters to destroy a company? I have no idea what you're talking about. Mm, let's see what we got. Let's see what the... Uh, let's use our intuition. What did the community say? They said you lie. You are a liar! This is industrial sabotage, Ryan. It's all part of your campaign. You're delusional, detective. What campaign? Oh, I know that. Uh, um, you had these... Whose face was that? Clemens looks smug. I want to punch him. Look at that. He's like... Durr! All right, you had these anarchist pamphlets. That's your campaign. Your locker is full of pamphlets. Clemens told us how you were always foisting them on people. Sure. I spread the pamphlets. A guy has to do something. Insta heat heaters break down every day. They're still peddling the same lousy design that they lifted from Hephaestus. Insta heat bought out Hephaestus? Them, Vulcan, Pyro, and a bunch of other companies. And you still work for them. A guy has to work. Oh, great. And the directors of the company. How do you feel about them these days? You work it out. What about Insta Heat Model 70? You know how to reverse a diaphragm in the regulator valve of a Model 70 heater? No, I don't. He's not looking at me straight. Um. Do we have anything? Maybe the regulator valve? The heater? His boss said it was easy to change it. I think you're lying? If you know enough to do your job, you know enough to do that repair. You're lying, Ryan. And how do you think you can prove that? Because your boss said it was easy to do? <laughs> your boss at Instaheat said that you've all been trained to do it. It's a common repair. Are you calling him a liar? Okay. So I know how it's done. But what would be the point? You'd just end up with a gas leak and then a small fire when you turn the pilot back on. And if you didn't reset the pilot and the gas spread, what was the cause of the fire in your own home, Ryan? I won't tell you. <laughs> hmm... What can you tell me about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nothing. Bullshit. Do you have anything to connect him to that, though? We need something with his name on it. The only guy that would be would be the, um... Up there, because I think all these other clues are newer, aren't they? Yeah, I... You're not telling the truth, don't you? I think Suburban is a front for your anarchist buddies. They're arranging for people to be out of town while you burn their houses down. Suburban? What's that got to do with me? That's Farley's bilk. He's the one with the cozy agreement with those fascists. What about the attempted you know, murder? History of violence. I have no such thing. You're lying. Don't, don't we have evidence that he's got a record? We're talking to Ryan Clemens, right? No. This one. Yeah. You're lying. You're lying, Ryan. And how exactly are you going to prove that? Um, you have a criminal record, and we know about it. You were charged with attempted murder, Ryan. It was a court case. No criminal liability was the verdict. They said that they couldn't have known that the faulty heater installation would cause a fire. All I know is I lost my whole family. And the company that was responsible got away with it. What would you do? Which company? As Fastos Water Heater Company. 
Doesn't it seem kind of bullshitty, though, that it's convenient that the houses that need to sell are burning? We're still going to charge him. Matthew Ryan, I'm charging you with committing a series of arsons and for the murders of Hank Sawyer, Edwina Sawyer, Henry Sawyer, and Jessica Sawyer. You're putting an innocent man away here. You hear me? I didn't set any fires. I didn't kill that family. Oh, well. Have fun in prison. Make a butt, buddy. You won't be lonely then. Phelps, what you did to your wife and kids is not America. My wife threw me out. Did I ask for your opinion? You're here to listen to mine. What I was going to say before I was interrupted was you did a good job on the Stefan Sawyer case. We don't often get results in arson, so well done. What about me? Do I get a little stamp on my hand or a lollipop or something? What you get is another case. He's so needy. One, unfortunately. Our partner is like, I need love too, love me. Speaking of which, viewers, I need love too, love me. Yeah, I kind of hit somebody with my car. Yeah. Only two fucking stars? Yeah, I did a little damage. Whatever. <laughs> it was fun, though. Hey, it's Japan! Do, 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 do. Shoot the Emperor. Get his magic sword. Then you can be Emperor. That's how it works. Kind of. If you don't believe me, look it up. He's got a magic sword. <laughs> Boom! Man, what if their family's in there? That's what the invasion of the mainland would have been if we would have had to invade the islands. Thank God we didn't. And by that I mean the homeland islands beyond Iwo Jima. You're two blocks behind first and second. We have more buildings to clear. You know our orders, There's Sergeant. There's barely a building left standing or not on fire in your zone, Cole. Is your sector full of Japs? Questioning my command. The captain doesn't want anyone falling behind. Tell the captain we will join him when the job is done. Just give us the word, Sarge. We'll take care of him. He should be sectioned. That Jap lover's a fucking liability. We're here to kill Japs, not our own people. Starcross, son of a bitch. No one wants to serve under him. He's bad fucking luck. Can it? We have a job to do here. If I can live with it, you can too. Kelso! Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye.